All right, welcome. This is going to uh, uh, be a fun one. This is what happens when you get five. Although this is only about this is f I think four um, four advent calendars, all the micro builds thrown in there, plus two commander stations that I need to break down. Uh, since I got two of the clone commander sets, and uh, man, there's so many small little pieces. That uh, that I've gotta kind of get all sorted and separated out and all that kind of stuff. So th that's the good news, bad news with the advent calendars is that you get a lot of uh, parts for my collection. The bad news is that it just takes a lot of time and effort to sort through these things uh, to make them uh, useful, essentially. Um, and there's just so many small parts, so I. Uh, as I kind of should probably open a few of these up, get them all all prepped. Let's see. Uh, should I have some of these out uh, because I'll probably use them. Uh, so that so we're just kind of getting the area set up, <laughs> so I can just easily uh, kind of put some of the parts. I know uh, we've got some. I've got my cylinder drawers. There'll probably be a lot of those. Uh, I can only imagine some of the wedges. There's probably a few. Probably not too many of those um, wedges. Let's, let's grab those out of there. Darth Vader. But uh, this is what happens, you know, when you, I mean, the good news is that you just get, there are a lot of really, really nice parts to add to your collection from the, from the advent calendars. And, uh, you know, it, it, it adds up over time. I've got all the figures over here. Um, here's some of the cylinders. Those will go in there. Man. It's just all these tiny parts that gonna get off. There's probably a lot of stuff that's gonna go fly into. Oh man, this is gonna be a trick. Uh, I definitely won't get through all of this. There's no way. I feel this is kind of where I need to be. Uh, I need to be watching some football right now while I'm doing this. Uh, accessory, so that's a different, uh, I know this, I seem to have a lot of these, uh, these skates, it's like the hot new part in Star Wars, there we go, there's a one by, I've got, and I did a lot of separating, so this, of my one buys, so this will be good. Uh, let's see. Dang, there's a lot of... I wonder how many of these bucket handles I ended up getting. Um, there we go. Man. More parts for the face. There's these uh, triggers and that. Okay, so that, that's just the extra spare parts of one advent calendar. Jeez. This is just gonna take a while. So it's just me and ranting. Like, did you really? I mean, the micro, micro builds, I mean, a few of them are really nice, but they're really not that great. Um, this part goes over here, and it definitely feels like a, I mean, it's, it's a fun activity, but it also feels like they could do so much better with almost maybe like an advent character pack or something. I don't know. I'm just kind of going off the rails at this point, but. Okay. Put that 
there. We uh, it it also it feels like that was where the the twenty twenty two advent calendar over the last few now mind you. I don't even really have much memory of the 2021 and 2020 uh, advent calendars. But from doing some of the earlier ones, it's weird. They would have like, there would be a couple really good micro builds, but then there were some really, really bad ones, like beyond bad. Here's more bucket handles. Let's go. Bucket handles. Let's do it. And uh, these uh, plates, we'll just dump those right in, boom, just like that. Um, that's where I like, that's where I definitely like having the cups out. I've been getting more and more of like wing, you know, type angled pieces um advent calendars have a lot of those i mean look at these right there different colored different sizes different coloring breaking down a full shovel but like some some of the micro builds are bigger and they have really nice parts like this but just people want their figures i mean that's what we need it's what we expect. We'll put printed stuff over here. You know, we just, uh, we definitely need uh, weapons. I just kind of throw, I have a weapons bin here. We'll just throw, throw those in there. Getting dark at red three buys. That's awesome. Really, really pumped about that. I don't know where I'm gonna put these. Gotta put them somewhere. So much breaking down to do. Oh, painful. Um, but the thing about breaking things down is then you can also. You, uh, my my kind of my new thing is to is going to be doing a little bit more building upwards. So like smaller builds. Um, smaller builds where I'm kind of building upwards, because it'll take a lot of parts and they'll look nice. little parts those are really nice the guns can go right in there and the variety of parts yeah there's a uh, yeah, because there was four, there was five, at least, let's see here. Yeah, five of these printed parts, just tons of printed parts. Just super pumped, super pumped about that. Um, and this uh, command center. <clears throat> Woo. Uh, flags. A lot of flags. This takes tons of time doing the old uh, stripping of parts. Plus, it never hurts getting a more black planks. Feels like going to a prick a brick wall with this uh, this little little mini hall. Now that uh, 
you know, and that's part of it too, is that you did not I did get to enjoy the build. And now, while I don't necessarily enjoy the breaking down of the build, I'm going to get to enjoy the the rebuilding process, potentially. And if I ever did want to rebuild these again, I, I could do so. As long as I make it so that it's fairly easy to... Uh, fair, fairly easy to locate the parts is the biggest thing that you find as you're kind of like building through things and nothing like a red one by being the whole reason this thing can be first order <laughs> a lot of these parts lots of dark red slope here These will be useful. These are like brickhead level type stuff. Uh, I've got a bin for these. I should, I should just put all that stuff right in there. I don't know where that'll go. Bucket handle. Let's go. Buckle handle br brigade. True one by two plates. The cylinders will go in their own bin because they are. And that'll go in there. Uh, really unique part, this little circular. There's not, there aren't too many of those. Just gonna keep rolling. This is why like even like music or anything would have been probably a good idea to have on right now while you're building. Ooh, these, I've got this bin. This bin is not too far. There's a bone. There we go. And the white. And that and these plates. Huh. All right. Oh man, the the Christmas tree. <laughs> this is from the uh, Christmas tree, 2011. Funny part about the Christmas tree. Is that I had to pull it out of my collection to make it happen because I there was two different lots from a figure standpoint uh, to kind of make it all work so who knew I was kind of running low on uh, one by threes It's not the easiest part in my collection where there's just a ton of a ton of it abundant. So I was able to find it all, but I had to dig deep. Uh, who knows what sets I was capitalizing, cannibalizing from <laughs> uh, to, to do that. So, all right, here's a big, big old fat radar dish. Millennium Falcon, keep the radar dishes over there. Got this. And that goes here. Another uh, old school part. I do have a bin for that one. 
Yeah, that's remember. Actually, this is the other one I had to dig deep and pull out of the collection too. Um, Man, this is just taking forever. Good old rock work. Take that. Not as many singles as I thought, at least so far. It's a pretty substantial amount of parts, but it looks like a, a regular set that you'd be building. And this is the Holiday Gronk. Gronk? Yeah, I almost don't want to break this B-Wing down. Weapon rack, let's go. Another weapon rack. Yes. So let's let's do one more. This is a pretty good, you know. This is we did a little bit of a chunk. Actually, let's uh, finish these weapons. This weapon rack. I was wondering why there's not ever. Jeez, there's so many of these. Something tells me I feel like I need one more, <laughs> like two more of these. I don't know. I feel like you can just never have enough of these things. Would it even help? I don't know. You'd think of this was a common part, but that there aren't a ton of those. Those are nice. Really, really nice. Alright, we sure? One more? Let's do one more. This will be an easy one. Easy one, we think. Good old A-Wing. So, all right, yeah, we got, we got plenty. Here, we got, let's take out the Ewok Village. This thing's like, like a gimme for what we have out. Most of it's right here. In the center, these all flow into here. Very special orange. And then these are all cylinders. And we'll all go in here. So that's that's how easy it is. Just gotta keep going one at a time. This has been the uh, vlog for the uh, the breakdown of advent calendars that literally just it's 
This is going to take a while to break these down. Thanks for catching me. Catch, we'll catch you on the next one. Vlog part two. I'm going to close the show down uh, and break all these down and get them in the collection as fast as I can. Thanks and have a great one. <laughs>